Well, all right, ladies and gentlemen. And let me tell you, you know, Nick gave Nick actually had gave you the prelude of some of the things I'm going to talk to you about. But let me really, really tell you what Nick and Ann Brown were about and how we got started in this business. You see, we followed all the rules. We went to school. We got those degrees. We got the cars, the house, the kids, the bills. You know, on the outside, everything looked great. But on the inside, we were struggling. Y'all, we were broke. And, you know. We were trying, we were robbing Peter to pay Paul. We were trying to figure out what we were going to do. And then Uncle Sam wrote us a letter. He had the audacity to wrote a, write us a letter and say we owed him some money. And so we were like, wait a minute, what are we going to do? And then our 93 year old aunt invited us to a cruise party. And you know, we wanted to go to the cruise party and we wanted to support her. How do you not support your 83 year old aunt? Well, let me tell you, we went to the cruise party, but on the way, I looked at Nick and I said, let me tell you something. Don't sign up for nothing. We ain't going to do nothing. We're going to eat the chicken wings and we're going to eat. We're going to enjoy the potato salad. And I, Virginia, made some great deviled eggs. And I said, you know, I'm going to have some of those deviled eggs. But I'm telling you, don't sign us up for anything. And so we agreed. We went into the party, had a great time. We were dancing and then it got time. They were like, okay, it's time to pay your deposit. So we moved way in the back. And so the director at that time that was actually coordinating it just said, got back on, on, on in front of the room and said, okay, well, we got, we got some deposits, but let me just tell everybody some other options that you have. And then she started talking about how we could actually, if we got a group together, we could actually, we could possibly go go on this cruise with a discount. Then she also started talking about, hey, if you if we got a group together, we could absolutely get paid to go. And then she said, there's also a way, if you have a home-based business, you can actually write it off on your taxes as well. Well, let me tell you, they were talking to me. And so we didn't get started that day, but we did go home and talk about it. And it wasn't long before we got started. In fact, at that time, Nick was working for one of those three letter organizations, you know, the CIA. And before we could get started, they had to check out the company. So we had to write it up and get approval for him to, for us to be able to be a part of this company. And guess what? It didn't even take 24 hours for them to come back and say, yes, this is a legitimate company. And we we definitely wish you well, definitely get started. So let me tell you, we got started and we haven't looked back. And so because of that, we are absolutely excited to share with you today what we've learned. So I say aloha. That's right. Are you ready? I hope you're ready because we are ready to actually show you something that could change your life. You see, we're helping others pursue empowerment. We're a company of hope. And I know that hope means that, that hope empowerment means different things for different people. But before we get started, I want you to know that this is a legitimate company. That's right. We are talking about a home based business. So it's not a travel club. It's not something fly by night. You will get a 1099 and that you can submit with your taxes um, through, the, through the IRS. So that is a legitimate company. But let me tell you, if you read this, practicality dictates that everyone's results will vary as we are all unique and different. Basically, it takes hard work to, to be successful, to make a substantial income in this business or in any business. Now, some people will make no money at all because some people will choose not to do anything. And that's cool. That's the great thing about our company is that you can make as much money as you want. So if you don't want to make any, that's okay. You don't have to. But some people will make a lot. And so it's up to them because actually the earnings that you make are 100% dependent on your skills, your work effort, your commitment, your leadership capabilities, and market conditions. So it's totally up to you in terms of your success or lack of success. However, this is a legitimate business and our company founders have no problem paying you whatever you earn. So what does empowerment mean to you? For some people, it means time freedom. 
For some people, it means financial freedom. For some people, it means having the freedom to make choices. So you get to decide what it means for you. But let me ask you a question. Have you or anyone you know ever thought about increasing their income to offset rising costs, making dramatically more money than you're making now, or even generating time and financial freedom so you can travel and spend your time the way you want to? Perhaps you thought about getting a side hustle, but you didn't know what you wanted it to be in. But what if there was a way that you could actually do this from the comforts of your home? What if there was a way that you could earn part-time income that could absolutely change your full-time life? Well, if you can relate to any of that, then you can relate to travel. You see, Warren Buffett says, things that you like to do should be a hobby of yours, but the things the world does should be a business of yours. Well, when you think about that, travel is absolutely huge. It's the world's largest industry, and it's essential to the world's economy. Many countries' economies are based on travel and tourism. So think about how big is travel? $140 billion is generated through the movie industry. $165 billion is generated through the computer industry. $2.8 trillion is generated in the auto industry. And $4.1 trillion is generated in the mobile telecom industry. You know those, those cell phones, but get this. $9.6 trillion is generated in the travel and tourism industry. Ladies and gentlemen, if you're gonna swim in a pond, you wanna make sure you're swimming in the biggest pond. Because if you're swimming in the biggest pond, guess what? That means you take you get you get more wet or you get more saturated. How about that? Well, ladies and gentlemen, have you ever been to St. Louis? Have you ever visited the Golden Arches? Well, that's where our company our company headquarters are located. Not far from that at all. And see, our our leaders of our company have been leaders in the industry for years. You know, competitors have tried to imitate us. And a lot of them just learned directly from us and some of them just flat out copied us. But if you do the research on some companies, most of them want to make money off of you. Our goal is to make money with you. See, we only earn from the efforts that we actually help you with. So we only earn money when you earn money. Isn't that the right way? You know, our visionary, Coach Lord Palmer, has the vision of creating 10,000 very, very successful and affluent millionaires. Well, guess what? Scott Tomer, his son, and also Chris Coakley have taken the charge upon his retirement. And he didn't do too bad. See, we've already generated billions of dollars in sales, tens of thousands of $500 bonuses, $1,000 bonuses, and $10,000 bonuses have been paid out. In fact, we've already created hundreds of $1 million earnings. And get this, we did this without you. So just imagine what we could do when you come on board. You see, we're going to show you how to leverage your time, how to make money online, build passive income, how to save money, and even save money on your taxes. And we're going to teach you how you can earn those unlimited $500, $1,000, and even $10,000 bonuses. Have you ever been to New York? Well, if you have, nine times out of 10, you bought your travel online. Well, get this. You usually check a couple of sites and you come up with the best prices. You know, you probably go to a popular online company. But just imagine, what if your mom had her own website? And you had to choose between that popular online company or your mom. Well, mom wins every time. Well, so what if you could get access to the same technology that Expedia, Travelocity, Priceline, all of those popular online sites have? What if you could do that? What if you could have your own site? What if you could actually make money while you sleep? Well, if you can grasp that concept, I want to introduce you to different packages. The first package, and remember I told you to have pen and paper, write this down, travel income package. We call it the tip, the travel income package. It includes a personalized travel site that's powered by Priceline. So you're getting the same price, you're getting the same products, 
It also includes a discounted travel site with prices so low that they're password protected and the ability to become a travel specialist. And we'll go into what that means in the very near future. See, we are in partnership with Travel Travmanity that actually that actually part that actually runs our travel site. You get a personalized travel site with your name on it. That's right, it's yours. Your name is in the corner. So your friends and family know who they're doing business with. It's powered by the same company that owns Booking.com, the world's number one booking engine. It's the same hotels, same cruises, same cars at the same price. The only difference is, is now instead of somebody you don't know gets paid, you do. That's right. You get paid and you have the ability to be paid 24 hours a day. How cool is that? See, but it's so much more than just travel. I see, we also offer travel insurance through Travel Guard. And so you don't have to be an insurance agent. Your clients can just go to your site, choose what they need, and book that and, and get the travel that they need. But get this, the great thing is that because it was done on your site, you actually get the commission from that. Have you ever heard of Ticketmaster? That's right. Ticketmaster is not something like Ticketmaster. It's not like it's not like Flicketmaster or Picketmaster. It's actually Ticketmaster, the where you get the tickets for concerts and shows. Well, guess what? That's one of our partners. And whenever someone gets a ticket from your site, you get paid. Have you thought about getting a passport or visa? Nine times out of 10, you probably know someone who needs one. Well, guess what? Well, when you get your passport and visa from your site, somebody, your, when, the, when somebody gets their passport and visa from your site, that generates a check for you. You get paid. Have you ever heard of honeymoon wishes? You probably haven't. But let me tell you, it was great. Nikki and I had the opportunity to use her honeymoon wishes years ago when we got married because we got married a little later in life. We didn't want the towels, the sheets, all the blender. We didn't need all of that stuff, but we did want a nice honeymoon. So guess what? We registered and I guess paid for our honeymoon. We had a wonderful time. We took a seven day cruise. We had chocolate covered strawberries. We had champagne. We took excursions. We did all kinds of stuff. But get this, we got over $1,800 in gifts and then another $1,000 cash. So guess what? Think, think about this now. We went on our honeymoon. Our honeymoon was paid for. We had money to spend, came back home, got a commission because it was done on our site, and then wrote it off on our taxes. Now, come on now. You talk about taking advantage of being, getting married, let me tell you, we had a great time in more ways than one. So if you know anyone that's that's ready to book their honeymoon or ready to schedule their honeymoon, tell them about honeymoon wishes because it absolutely can make a difference. Now, remember I told you that we also have the discounted travel site? I call it the hookup site because it's for people, your friends and family that want the hookup, that don't wanna pay full price. Well, you give them your Vortex and your Vortex is a discounted travel site that allows you to, to give it away to your friends and family. They set up their account and they get discounts. Prices so low, they're password protected. The customers save money 80% of the time. That's right. The customer saves money and you make money. So now you have an online presence where you can actually make money again 24 hours a day. I'm trying to figure out the best way to put this. So I apologize for that. So let's say that you wanted, that your family wanted to go on a Disney vacation, close to the main entrance, seven nights in a two, two bedroom accommodations. The lowest internet price is right about $1,600, but the Vortex price is right at about $1,200. Guess what? Your clients save $474. They're happy because they're saving money. But get this, you earn $284. That's right, just because you pointed them to your site. Now, what about, you might not want to go to Disney, but you might want to go to Rome. Seven nights in Rome in, the, in really nice accommodations. Your lowest internet price is right about $1,300. Your Vortex price is $931. Guess what? They save $400. So your friends and family are happy, but you earn $244. And I want you to get this. I didn't say that you were booking anything. I didn't say 
that you had to find the, find their accommodations. I said you pointed them to your site. And they did the same thing that they do with Expedia, Priceline, or Travelocity. Let me ask you, did you take the Expedia training course? Absolutely not, because there isn't one. Because you can figure it out. And so when you give your friends and family their site, your site, they already know what they want. They already know how to book it. All you have to do is give it to them. And if your price is less than what they're finding on those other sites, and nine times out of 10, it will be, they're going to book it on your site. And because of that, you get paid. Now, what about New York? What about Manhattan? One of the most expensive places to stay. The lowest internet price is right at about $1,200, but our Vortex price, $800. So your clients, your friends and family, they save $374. Now, I don't know about you, but that's the hookup. I mean, shoot, $374 savings, that's significant. But get this, our company is going to send you a check for $224 just because you shared it with them. See, sharing is caring, and that's what it's all about. Have you ever been to the Bahamas? Are you familiar with Atlantis, one of the most beautiful resorts ever? Well, guess what? Our travel site allows you to go to Atlantis and so many other things because as a travel professional, you get the opportunity to do so much more. Let me tell you, if you wanted to focus on cruises, like what we're talking about tonight, or maybe all-inclusive resorts, maybe even educational travel or corporate travel, if you wanted to be a convention planner, maybe you want to focus on faith-based travel, maybe you might want to do destination weddings or groups and tours. No matter what, it's available to you. It's totally up to you, whatever you're interested in. For instance, if you want to be a cruise planner like Miss Carol Lee Miles, let me tell you, one of our partners actually volunteered to help plan the cruise. They went for free and made over $15,000. Ms. Carol Lee is going to show us how we can do that to do, do that as well. And what about a destination planner? You know what? One of our partners were, actually coordinated a destination a trip to the Holy Land um, for her church. She went for free and earned $21,000. And the pastor went for free as well. Do, do y'all know any pastors out there? Well, guess what? Let's tell them that they're in their, their church could go to the Holy Land. How cool is that? And if you're willing to help them do that, you can get flat out paid. What about all-inclusive resorts? I love all-inclusive resorts. We just came back from one where you pay one price and everything is included. It just makes sense. Well, guess what? One of our partners did that for their graduation trip, their son's graduation trip. They went for free, made over $7,000. Well, what about those corporate and convention planners, right? You know, you need somebody that's going to pull that together. Well, that somebody could be you. And it could really be you. Wouldn't it be cool if it were you and you made $7,000 for actually helping somebody do a convention, something that they were going to do anyway? Now, what about Bora Bora? Have you ever heard of Bora Bora Tahiti? Well, let me just tell you, that's for the top, the top, the top. The, uh, for the savvy traveler. Let me just explain to you. Bora Bora, when you actually get, uh, actually are able to stay in one of these bungalows, let me tell you, it's not a hut. This, these are not huts. These are bungalows and you got to put your nose in the air. Bungalows. You got to say it. Bungalows. Well, let me tell you, when you get an opportunity to stay in one of these bungalows, you get to, you get, I mean, it's just a totally different lifestyle. Just imagine rolling out of bed and just, if you want to go for a swim, you're going for a swim in the ocean. Imagine a glass bottom floor where you're actually looking at the marine life right there. You can see the shrimp. You can see the crab. You can see the exotic fish. It, just imagine a, a bungalow with no kitchen. So ladies, you're not cooking. No, 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 no. You you have a little, a little, a little um, walkie talkie. And you, you, you know, you, you, you tell Guido what you want. And Guido comes rolling out, rolling everything out to you, your fresh fruits and vegetables, anything that you want. So you don't have to cook. You don't have to raise a, a finger. And you're just sitting out there catching the sun, enjoying the lifestyle. See, that is how the savvy traveler travels. And so if you're a savvy traveler, well, let me tell you, you're going to be interested in our top package. That's right. Our top package. Write this down. Our travel owner package. So we were just talking about the tip, the travel income package. Now we're talking about the top. 
because we want you to go to the top. Now, a travel owner package includes everything that we were just talking about with the tip, but guess what? You get access to wholesale travel pricing. You get discounts. You get the ability to earn free vacations. That's right, free, 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 free. So get this. There are more ways to save as well. But with our top package, you save 70% on hotels, resorts, and 30% on cars and, cars and cruise, cruises, car rentals and cruises. Now, let me give you an example. Las Vegas, seven nights, four adults in two bedroom accommodations. Generally pays about, it generally runs about $1,300, $1,300 $1, or $1,400. But guess what? Our top, our savvy travelers only pay $459. That's right. So they keep that $927 in their pocket. How cool is that? Then what about an Alaskan cruise? See, we're talking about cruising today. Now you can actually pay $4,700 for two adults in a balcony stateroom, or you can be like our top savvy travelers and only pay $3,500 and keep $1,200 in your pocket. I don't know about you, but I got something else I could do with that $1,200. And what about Bora Bora? See, most people know that Bora Bora can be kind of pricey. Two adults, $6,700 for seven days, but not you, not the top savvy traveler. No, you're only paying 3,500 and you're keeping $3,200 in your bank account. Ladies and gentlemen, it just makes sense. We even give you more ways to say, are you familiar with any of these brands, Saks Fifth Avenue, Kohl's, Bed Bath & Beyond? Nordstrom Rack, Brookstone, or Macy's? Well, if you are, then guess what? You can actually earn reward credits where now you can travel, use those reward credits to travel for free. That's right, free. Do you like to eat? Most of us do. Well, get this. We give you discounts at more than 18,000 restaurants. And it's based on your zip code or where you're going. And you can find restaurants wherever you are. And so now you get an opportunity to try different things. Are you a foodie? I know I am. And so now you can try those different dishes for less. Have you ever thought about going to Paris? I have. Well, what about going to Paris for free? It just makes sense. Well, remember those reward credits I told you you were accumulating? Well, you can get those and pay for your trip to Paris. That's right. You get reward credits on your own personal travel, but you also get reward credits on everybody you gave the hookup. That's right. Everybody that actually booked travel on your board sets generates reward credits for you as well as a check. And so now you can use those reward credits just like cash. We've used those reward credits to pay for trips. Nick actually bought flowers for me for Valentine's Day using the reward credits. He took me away for a weekend getaway. We've actually gotten car rentals, even airline tickets using our reward credits. It absolutely makes sense. Now, I know we're talking about vacations and it's a lot of fun, but let's get serious here. See, vacations are good for you. And I'm talking about really good for you. See, annual vacations reduce heart disease risk by 32%. My father died of a heart attack. Had I known that the, the and he never took a vacation in his entire life. Had I known, I would have taken him on many, many more vacations. Did you know marital satisfaction has been linked to vacation frequency? That's right. If you want a happy marriage, go on vacation. Don't go, don't get seek a lawyer for arbitration. Go on a vacation. Vacations also contribute to higher positive emotional levels, less depression, lower blood pressure, even smaller waistlines, lower stress and boost the immune system up to 10 months. It even increases your chance of getting a raise or bonus. Come on, y'all. It just makes sense. Now you're feeling better. Now you're operating better. It just means everything to be able to relax and re let your body rejuvenate. See, we were talking about the tip package and the top package. Hopefully you got some notes because both packages are great, but the top is the best. With both of those packages though, our company does wants you to take a vacation. Therefore, they're gonna give you one. An anniversary reward trip. You get a seven day vacation every year that you are active with our company. How cool is that? seven nights at, at thousands of four-star resorts. And I want my husband, Nick Brown, to actually share with you 
our, so what we experienced at our last anniversary reward trip. We took that anniversary reward trip back here in April. We went out to Arizona, beautiful Scottsdale, Arizona. We went out there to celebrate your birthday and to see our grandson who we hadn't seen in, in, in since COVID. Well, ladies and gentlemen, we stayed at the beautiful Mirage Villa Resort at the base of the mountains in, in, in beautiful Scottsdale, Arizona. We had a bun, one bedroom condo. We had a full kitchen with all the amenities. We even had a fireplace. Now, you may ask, why would we need a fireplace in Arizona? Well, ladies and gentlemen, it can be 100 degrees during the day, but 32 degrees at night. So there was one night, it was a little bit nippy, and we kind of snuggled up along the fire and just reconnected and had a great time. We were also on the first level. So when we walked out of our patio, we were right at the beautiful pool. We had a 24-hour running waterfall. There were a couple of nights we went out on the patio, just had some wine, listened to the waterfall. You know, we got into our feng shui, and we just just reconnecting and loving on each other. But you know, ladies and gentlemen, had we not had that 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 vacation, it would have cost us three hundred dollars a night, three hundred dollars seven nights. We saved twenty one hundred dollars, and now we're looking at where we're going to take the next two anniversary vacation that we have in reserve. So thank you, Ann. Thank you, Nick Brown. Well, let me tell you, I'm putting you on the spot again because you brought this business to us because Uncle Sam, oh, Uncle Sam was in our pockets. And so your the tax advisor that you that that you actually knew told us y'all need to find a home-based business. He said, I don't know if you're gonna be washing windows. I don't know if you're gonna be cooking cakes. Mm -hmm. I don't know if you're gonna be cleaning offices, but you need to find something because Uncle Sam is about to chew, chew a piece off of you. And so thank goodness we found this. Nick Brown, could you tell our listening audience some of the things that we've been able to take advantage of? So once we started this and realized that we in this country, those who paid taxes and those who paid less taxes. We definitely wanted to be in that latter group of paying less taxes. So I learned that, you know, there was all different kinds of tax deductions. Matter of fact, there's over 422 tax deductions for small home-based business owners. And there's a book out there called 422 Tax Deductions by Bernard Kamaroff. I recommend that you go out and get that. So ladies and gentlemen, now what about being able to tax deduct a percentage of your mortgage or your rent? your utilities, your internet, your cable, your, your laptops, your PCs, your tablets, your iPhones, your cell phones, all these things were bills. Now they become business expenses. It's a home. So you want your landscape, you want your yard and everything to look good. You move out to your vehicle, you know, utilize your vehicle to go back and forth to, to take care of business. So how about your gas, your mileage, your registration, your tag renewals, your maintenance, all those things now become tax deductions. As I said earlier, there's over 422 tax deductions. Most people only know five to seven. So now we're able to get Uncle Sam out of our back pocket. Like you heard us say, we were able to pay off that, that Uncle Sam tag. We were able to pay off all of our cars. You heard Ann talking about her mom got sick. It's also financial. We've been able to help a lot of our family members. So ladies and gentlemen, what could you do with a five-figure tax refund? Could you pay off all your bills? Could you take that dream vacation that you're looking for? Could you send your kids to private school? Well, how about getting that luxury uh, vehicle that you always wanted? But what I love most of all, taking that extra money and diversifying your investment portfolio. All these things are available to you for having a small home-based business. Thank you, Ann, and back over to you. Well, there you have it, ladies and gentlemen. Well, I am so incredibly excited. It just makes sense, right? Well, let me tell you, if it makes sense to you, it's going to make sense to others. See, everybody you know will become your customer because it costs them nothing to buy through you and travel is the same price or less. And the benefit to you is you get paid. So some people that you talk to is going, are going to want their own sites. They're going to want to have their own business. 
Well, get this, when you begin building a network, you actually earn up to $110 for personal referrals. You get a 100% check match. You, when, when, when your new representatives are trained, our company actually gives, actually gives you a $500 bonus with each seven that's trained. You get res, residual income and residual income is when you do something one time and get paid for it over and over and over again. You actually get team referrals up to $80, unlimited $1,000 bonuses, $10,000 bonuses, a $25,000 one-time bonus. You can even earn $60,000 in your first 100 days. I don't know about you, but most jobs are not paying $60,000 in your first 100 days. See, we're talking about building wealth. And when you build wealth, guess what? We want you to wear your wealth. We want people to know that you've been successful. You can actually earn, you can actually earn an onyx, sapphire, emerald, ruby, or even a diamond. And diamonds are girls' best friends. My husband says diamonds are a man's, a man's best friend as well. What is it that you want? How do you see yourself? Where are you going? See, we have the industry's best recognition program. When you become a director, which simply means that you've helped a lot of people win, guess what? You can come, you can be compensated quite nicely for that. You know, our first level director, where you're earning up to seven thousand dollars every month, in addition to an additional thirty five hundred every single month, you absolutely actually get the opportunity to get that nice sharp jacket and other perks and benefits. Five hundred dollar bonuses, unlimited one thousand dollars, one thousand dollar bonuses. But as you continue to help your team and your team continues to help others. You, are, you have the opportunity to be pr promoted to level two director. And that's when you drive the company, jar, the company car, this beautiful, beautiful Jeep Wrangler. Guess what? You're earning up to $15,000 per month and an additional $8,000 per month in residual income. And as you continue to help people and they continue to help people, you're going to get promoted to level three director where you have your choice of driving a Mercedes, a Jag, or a BMW. It's totally up to you. At this point, you're earning about $25,000 per month with up to with an additional $16,000 per month in residual income. And again, as your team and you all are locking together and helping others win, you're going to promote it to be promoted to level four director. Well, now you're wearing your car. That Rolex presidential watch is worth eighty thousand dollars. Plus, you get your choice of a luxury vacation, vacation as well. So you're earning up to forty five thousand dollars a month, plus an additional thirty thousand dollars per month in residual income. Now. After that, as you continue to help people, you're going to be promoted to level five directors. Our level five directors get the choice of driving that Lamborghini, a Ferrari, or two-door or four-door Bentley. Which one would you want to drive? Well, let me tell you, you're earning up to $80,000 per month and with an additional $50,000 per month in residual income. So you can drive whatever you want, wherever you want. And as you're promoted to level six director, you're earning up to $110,000 every single month. Now you're a millionaire, plus an additional $90,000 per month. And you actually earn a $1 million cash bonus. At level seven director, you get the choice of a million dollar yacht, a vacation home, or a motor coach. You get, you're get you actually earning $150,000 per month up to $110,000 per month in residual income. And at level eight director, hey, you're doing everything that you want to do. Now you're helping people. Now you can actually build that wing on the hospital or put your name on the church. You can give, you can sponsor those orphanages, but do whatever your heart desires. You're now earning $100,000 per month and a guaranteed $3 million every single year. Ladies and gentlemen, what can you do? What will you do? Well, I'm telling you, we want to, we'd like to know what you like best. Did you like making money, saving money? Are, are you like us? You like a little bit of both. What is it? See, I know you're probably wondering what our startup cost is. And I'm here to tell you that it's not $50,000. Even though I did some research, did you know that most startup businesses costs around $50,000. You have to be $50,000 liquid to start. You know, I recently looked up 
cruise planners. Did you know you had to have, be $10,000 liquid to start a cruise plan, planner's business? Well, not with us. I'm telling you, it's not even $5,000, not even a thousand, even though it's worth it, it's worth so much more. It's less than a cell phone and a monthly family plan. See, our founders and our visionaries, they want everybody to succeed. So if you're in that space where you're saying, you know what, Ann, I'd love to be able to generate some more income. Well, you want to get started with our junior executive program where you get systems and mentors, you get the business expense tracking app, you get access to those unlimited $500 bonuses, $10,000 bonuses, and even $1,000 and even that $25,000 challenge is totally up to you. And you can get started for only $79 one time and $19.95 per month. That's right, $79 one time and $19.95 per month. It's totally up to you and what it is you want to accomplish. Let me tell you, think about this. What are you gonna do with your first $10,000 bonus? You know, we have some people in our company that's on their fifth $10,000 bonus on a spare time, part-time basis, an extra $50,000. Would that be significant? significant? Well, think about this. When would you like to make it? When you wanna start, it's totally up to you. See, the first thing is we're going to put you on, we're going to show you our products. We call it a test drive. And then you get to determine which package is best for you, the tip package or the top package. You get to upgrade to the tip or the top. And so you get an opportunity to try it out. You get an opportunity to see what it is that you like. We give you an orientation. We, we work with you. We answer all of your questions. And we definitely give you enough information so you can make a qualified decision. You either want to upgrade to the tip, upgrade to the top, or stay where you are at the junior executive level. But I'm telling you, the person that invited you today, nine times out of 10, is either at the top or getting started at the top. And so you want to be at the top as well. So definitely plan to be at the next event and start earning your bonuses right now. So what will you do? Well, you can do nothing if you want and everything stays the same, or you can absolutely get started today and change your circumstances. Never pay full price for travel again. Build residual income and reduce your income taxes. It's totally up to you. And so tonight, we want you to make the decision to improve your future today. And one of the things we want you to improve is how you travel, because we've got some cruise training coming up in a very few minutes and you don't want to miss it. So what if you could have the opportunity to take the cruises that you wanted, to build the life that you want, to generate the income that you want? What I'm telling you, if that's something that's interest, that you're interested in, make sure you get back with the person who invited you on this presentation this evening. Make sure you let them know what you're most interested in. You see, most people are one of three numbers. And remember your number. Number three is that person that says, thanks, but no thanks. Hey, I want to pay full price for travel. I'm not interested in saving. I'm not interested in traveling. I'm, I'm okay where I am. And that's okay. If that's you, okay, cool. But make sure you tell that person so that you can at least support them. You can at least get their vortex and support their business. Number two is that person that says, hey, you know what? I like this, but maybe I'm between checks right now. Or maybe I've got some questions. If you're number two, then make sure you tell the person that you're a number two and you've just got to work out some things. Or maybe you just have some questions that you want to you wanna ask. And number one, you're why we're here today. You're that person that says, you know what? You had me at Aloha. I am ready to get started and I cannot wait. So if that's you, then definitely get back with the person who invited you and let us get you started immediately because we want to put you, definitely get you closer to your wealthy place. We're going to do put you on some training immediately so that you can get, you can get the information that you need. So with that being said, again, get back with the person who invited you on this call today. With no further ado, I'd like to introduce to some and present to others 
the lady who absolutely has I am that has truly truly blown me away. I am so incredibly impressed with her, with her knowledge, and she just has a heart of gold. I mean, she always bends over backwards to help anybody, and she's building a phenomenal team nationwide. And she's everywhere. If you follow her on Facebook, she's always going somewhere, always. And I'm just like, do you ever stay at home? And guess what? I just found out tonight. Well, she has two homes, so. She, she's a, she's cross country all the time. Please help me welcome none other than cruise extraordinaire, Miss Carol Lee Miles. Might, might, <laughs> might help. <laughs> All right, probably going to have to move the other computer. <laughs> All right, guys, I am so excited to be here at the Gaylord um, National Harbor in Washington, D.C., to be with the fabulous team of Ann Brown, Ann and Nick, and um, quite a few others. We are just celebrating, just, uh, I just got home from Puerto Vallarta and uh, all inclusive, but guess what? Tonight our subject is training. So I'm gonna kind of run through uh, pretty fast because we do have that call tonight that we all wanna be on, that corporate call. but. Uh, we're just going to call this travel, travel and cruise training 101. Okay. You know, I think everybody has to have a motto and guess what my motto is dream it, speak it, write it and live it. That is the way I live my life. I'm just going to tell you briefly a little bit about my story. I didn't become a travel agent until 2008. And then I wrote my first book to help others because I was at a, uh, a convention. There were, there were 18,000 people begging for information. So I said, golly, if I could just have all of my knowledge for having already traveled around the world for so many years, then I could help, uh, help others. And that is what is so exciting for me to be able to share tonight. Um, uh, and talked a little bit about um, my experience of the countries, the continents, all seven continents. And you know, when I was at that convention with those 18,000 people, I met people like Jeannie Sharpless and Mary Cofield, and even Coach A from out in California. And guess what? They had no travel training. I'll bet you when Ann and Nick came in here, they had no travel training Woo! either. No, we didn't. Yeah, there you go. No, they didn't. And so as a travel agent or a travel advisor, as we're known now, we all started at ground zero, just like you and others in our company. It doesn't make any difference. So I sat down and made a plan. What was my why? I had to consider how much time I had. I had to consider how much money I wanted to invest. I wanted to consider what my passion is, my biggest passion. And of course, it was cruising. Because when I hit that seventh continent, I was on a cruise all the way to Antarctica. And I tell you what, it became my passion to make, um, make cruising my income. So, and I wanted to get my income back on travel. So the latest book that I did publish is called A Chosen Career in Cruise Hosting. So let's talk about goals because absolutely when uh, I had to sit down and make up my goals and I hope these might be able to help you a little bit. Please feel free to take a uh, camera and or your phone or whatever and copy any of the slides that you want because I think it might help you establish your own. See, I had a passion, uh, that passion for getting paid to cruise and how could I get the most bang for the buck with the time allotment that I had. 
So what did I do? I started out with CLIA, the Cruise Lines International Association. We all have the opportunity to do CLIA. It's a separate organization, but if you want to learn more about cruising, that's an additional way you can do it. Their classes are very minimal in cost. And I went all the way up to an elite cruise counselor with CLIA. How did I do that? I learned about groups. I learned about booking tools. I learned all of that stuff that, in, that is involved in cruise groups. So I just wanted to mention a couple of uh, opportunities for you. In the fall, come November the 2nd through the 4th, in Fort Lauderdale, there is Cruise World 2022, always in the fall. That's when that held, that is held. In the spring, there is always Cruise 360. Hi. <laughs> yeah. Oh, I don't have slides. I have any slides on. Um, oh my goodness, my goodness. They're just telling me that I Wonderful. <laughs> Hang on, folks, just a little technical. Well, there you have it, ladies and gentlemen. You don't have to be a professional. You don't have to have it all together. <laughs> there you go. You just keep trying to see, you figure I, it out. I don't have and so out. she is pulling up the screens. I happened to look at the screen myself, and I said, I thought she said we should be seeing some screen, and we could take pictures of the screen. Isn't <laughs> And so it looks like she is being there. And so if you you were looking for those for those um those those slides, we're getting those for you. I want to thank everybody for joining us tonight and definitely everybody who was able to actually put the screensaver. It looks beautiful seeing the blue water in the back. And so I want to thank y'all so much. And I tell you what, I know we have a, a corporate call coming up at 9 p.m. Wanted to remind everybody about that because we do have that corporate call coming up at 9 p.m. And here we go. Carol's got her screen. <laughs> <laughs> all right all right all right i wonder why when i kept looking at the screen i was seeing my face and i'm like oh goodness goodness everybody in my world knows that i am the least tech savvy person you've ever met so you can still be successful at group cruises okay <laughs> so um um yeah. okay if you're going to sell cruises a, a group you know, you already have your info for one, so you might as well sell as many space as possible. Just book a group. Go out and do it. Don't be afraid. In group space, now I'm talking ocean right now, not river. Usually it starts at eight cabins that you can reserve in a group without a dollar amount deposit, without a monetary investment. Usually one cabin equals two beds, right? So two beds equals a berth, okay? I mean, each bed is considered a berth. So some cruise lines hold space by cabins, some hold them by berths. So make sure when you're making your group, you know which is which. The cruise line determines what category of cabins are available for the group. They tell you, and then in those eight cabins, I usually hold some inside. That means there's no window. I hold some outside, which is a porthole or a window, and then I hold some balcony. So it's up to the cruise line if the agent can hold in all categories. It usually is so that you can do that. Try and get extra amenities for the group. What does that mean? It's extra perks that you can give your people, and they think this all comes from you, but really it is coming from the cruise line. So will you be with the group or will you have a Pied Piper? Well, what is a Pied Piper? 
say you're um, going to do a cruise for Christian couples uh, to improve their marriages. Well, you might, instead of going yourself, if you're not married for some reason, you might want to send the pastor and his wife. So you would set up the pastor as a Pied Piper, and he would be the one who would be actually um, helping with the group. You can sell FIT. That's a fully independent traveler. You can sell FIT, that uh, term is used a lot in travel, and move that cabin into the group. Why? Because say you don't have any suites, but your very important, most important client wants a suite. So they might book that suite as a fully independent and then be able to move it in and you will still get commission from that. So a uh, little bit more on groups. You don't have to sell all the cabins in your group, okay? So you might go, you can continue, usually you can continue to increase the number of cabins. Say you sell out your eight cabins. Well, you wanna know with the cruise line how many more cabins you can book at the same price. It may not be at the same price, it might be the next higher price. So guess what? When you publicize, that's the call to action. That's the important part that you want to be able to get them to book right away, okay? So try and have a group welcome party on board if you can. Sometimes that is, is provided with a GAP. That's a group amenity points. So if at all possible, like on Carnival, for example, they're very good about having a group welcome party. It might be in the, it might be bigger than just your group, but you can establish your little corner over in there. You get free drinks, you get to socialize, and it's a fun, fun way to start out your uh, group. So another thing is to try and seat your group together, especially at dinner, because within the group then, say you have three or four tables in your group, those table, when in those tables, the people can move around and meet others, converse, have some uh, fun, relaxed time together at dinner when you come back from all of those awesome excursions that you're gonna be taking. So know what the rules are for carrying on board. And that is to say, sometimes you can take a case of soda, sometimes you can take water, sometimes you can take usually two, a couple of bottles of wine. But you need to know that so that you can tell the people in your group what is allowed on your group cruise. So it's up to the cruise line if you get if you still get amenities if the group doesn't make. Okay, so say you had eight cabins and you only booked and you only got six cabins. Well, do those six cabins still get the amenities that you have set up for the group? These are things that you want to talk through when you're setting up a group. Uh, they allow you, whether or not the cruise line allows you to put up a welcome sign on your people's doors. Now, this is not a huge advertising display, okay? This is not something that says surge all over the place. This just is a welcome, maybe a picture of a ship or something like that. Welcome aboard your cruise host, Carol Lee and Larry, okay? If that is um, allowable, you will find that out at what we used to call the purser's desk, but it's the, the welcome desk. You need to go there and ask the questions so that you will know if you can do that. A lot of cruise lines provide some sort of gifts, okay? Like Carnival usually, has a deck of cards, for example, with a carnival logo on it. Well, guess what? I don't know if they still do now since that big C word <laughs> attached itself to all of us, but if they still do, then I would just go to the desk on carnival with my little bag and say, I've got 18 cabins. Can you give me 18 decks of cards? Or if I have 18 cabins and there's two that are not husband and wife, could I have 36 decks of cards? And guess what? They'll just load up my little bag. And then guess what? That's going to come from me. That's going to come from me. And you also need to know if you have a group coordinator on board. Some cruise lines do. They don't always have. 
So who is that person at that registration desk that you're going to be working with to arrange the various things for your group? I hope that makes sense. How do you start your group? What I do is I call the cruise line itself. Uh, whatever cruise line that you're going to book on, the ones that we are able to book ourselves, um, uh, <laughs> you would just call the cruise line and you would uh, tell them what you want to do, how many um, cabins you want to book and go from there. You need to set up your live list to market to others. Well, what does that mean? Well, what I've done in my career is to decide where I wanted to go, right? If I wanted to cruise to the Bahamas, then I would set up a cruise that included the Bahamas as a stop, okay? So then I set that up as a group and that way I will either go at a travel agent, travel advisor rate, or I would be able to um, get the commissions on all the people in my group, okay? So do your homework because some six star lines can compare to some premium lines. What does that mean? Well, if you look at the cold hard costs of what they're gonna be paying, then oftentimes you can do a six star for the same price as a premium, for example. You wanna brand you. You wanna brand the name of your travel company, okay? Not anybody else, but your own travel company. My last name is Miles. My husband's last name is Love. So we are Miles yeah. of Love Travel. You wanna brand that name to your travel company. Yeah, I did the right thing in marrying Mr. Love. <laughs> How about that? So know which cruise lines are kid friendly versus adult centered. This is very important. I gave you a few examples here to think about. Disney Cruise Line. You know Disney is going to be all about kids, right? And you can come, become a Disney specialist. Did you know that a lot of adults, parents, grandparents, great grandparents, they still love that brand. They still want to go on Disney. They know they're going to have all of that wonderful seafood on the lunch buffet or whatever. So Disney is very popular. Viking Cruise Line. Viking has cruise and river. Usually no children. Okay. On Viking. Holland America. Holland is one of those, H-A-L for short. They are trying to change their image because they used to be known as the wheelchair cruise capital of the world. <laughs> However, now they are changing their image and it's geared much more to kids now and multi-generation. So don't forget your multi-gen groups, because guess what? You've got those grandparents and they've got six kids and they've got four more grandkids. That's cabins and cabins and more cabins. So these lines, Royal Caribbean, Carnival, Norwegian. There are tons of kid and adult activities all on those three major lines. Tons of kid and adult activities. Princess Cruise Line, multi-gen again, especially in Alaska. And they even provide some certifications for young adults, you know, a little bit older, but young adults, like when you go into um, Denali National Park, for example. So know that Princess and Holland practically own Alaska, okay? So if you want your, they get more passes to the um, inside passage, the, um, not the inside passage, into Glacier National Bay. Thank you. They do more, uh, they get more um, um, agree agreements made. They get more stops there than any other cruise line. They also have 
together, they have um, resort areas where they've got princess cabins and, and Holland America cabins. And so think about that when you're booking Alaska, especially. Seaborn, Silver Sea, Regent Seven Seas. These are examples of six star. Well, just an example, that's just three examples. Virgin Voyages, you re may remember that Virgin Voyages started their cruise company just during COVID actually. We were actually invited to go free on a Virgin Voyage as a travel advisor to check out that cruise line. Well, let me just clue you in because you need to know your clients, right? It leans heavily toward the LGBTQ community. That is very important if you have a church group and they're going to pray every day. I'm not, I'm not saying anything against the community. I'm just saying that that might not be the best choice for that particular group. So just wanted to point that out if you haven't heard much about Virgin Voyages. The ships are beautiful. Food is exquisite. It is a great cruise line. River cruising is very, very, very popular today. Don't miss these dollars. Take your training on uh, the various uh, cruise lines that offer um, river cruising. Very, very, very important. Viking is a very good product. It's kind of like the, you would say the lower end. However, they have some really good benefits. And guess what? The commissions are probably higher on Viking than other uh, river cruise companies. Why is that? Because there are no non-commissionable amounts. Everything is commissionable. So Viking River, very good. Insurance, it's a must. Um, and mentioned about insurance and, and uh, travel agent insurance. I don't know if this amount is exactly correct now. We do have our policy this year, but it's around about $250 a year. Um, and it's only half that if it's just one person. So my husband and I spend a less than $300 for both of us to be insured for the whole year. That's called, a, uh, that's called an agent annual policy. That includes 100,000 accidental death, 300,000 emergency evac, 25 medical expenses, and so much more. It is well worth it. If you travel at all, and everybody needs travel insurance. You need this perk. As an agent, as an advisor, you really need this perk. There are other agencies that are offering travel agent insurance now, and you could check those out too. I know one is Allianz, A-L-L-I-A-N-Z, I believe it's spelled, for example. Errors and emissions insurance. This covers your business in case a client sues you. Well, that protects you. Prices vary. You can Google e and insurance for agents, okay? Why do I say errors and emissions is important? If you're booking a lot of travel, if you're booking a lot of cruises, okay, you may not be covered. I'm no attorney, <laughs> but you may not be covered. We, you can say, well, I thought that the company like the host agency, they would have E and O. They probably do. Okay, they probably do have E and O. However, if you recommend that they take a walk into town and they fall off the um, uh, dock <laughs> because they've been drinking too much, but you had suggested that they go into town. See, these are the things that whole insurance issue brings up, and so. Just check it out if you're doing a lot of cruising yourself. Protect yourself, you will be glad you did. So register for travel agent group emails. Um, some of you out there in, uh, in agent world or advisor world, you know these are just a few, 
But for example, and a lot of these are in your Travmanity, Travmanity back office. If they're not there now, they're going to be. Remember your Travmanity back office is under construction. It is looking so great. It's looking so great, you guys. It is not finished yet, okay? So if some of these things aren't back there yet, they will be. So meanwhile, register for uh, travel advisor group emails, such as Travel Weekly, for example, Travel Age West. There's one called TRO Travel Gram. There's one called Mail Pound that does familiarization trips. Mm -hmm. Cruise lines, watch for free cruise offers. Right now, right now, MSC has an offer for one free cabin for travel advisors and half price for five more. Guess what? There's a group right there. Your friends, your family, they're going to get a great deal. I know Rick and Brenda Reese are going to take their whole family over Christmas. Wow. And so they are going free. You do have to pay the gratuities. Okay. But, uh, but the others, it's half price for five more cabins. So watch for these various things, because where are they going to come from? They're going to come from those group emails. If you're uh, signed up for MSC emails, you need to be aware of every single cruise line that you know of, go in there, uh, fiddle around on their website, see where the travel agent uh, bar is, it usually at the bottom or the top or whatever. Um, take specialty training. After you have $100 in travel commission in your Trav Manatee travel commission, guess what? You get a free cruise. Mm -hmm after you have taken their classes let me let me reiterate let me explain that a little bit more after you have a hundred dollars in travel commissions you can go and take princess's travel training there are 24 modules they take about an hour apiece when you reach the level of princess commodore you're ready to take your uh free cruise with that, you still have to pay gratu uh, um, gratuities. Uh, we still paid, um, no, we didn't even pay taxes on that one. We did a 17 day free cruise to um, uh, Europe. It was 17 days, four countries, uh, mm, Spain, Portugal, it, Italy, and Monaco. So uh, we were not married at the time. We had two different um, websites, travel websites. And so Larry took his training and we also did a Panama Canal. Okay, that was another 15 day cruise because he got his Commodore because he had his own website. I have mine. So we did one for each of those. NCL, Norwegian Cruise Line. You can work up by various um trainings and you can work up to a master's degree and then you have to sell i believe it's five cabins or six could be seven by now i don't know the latest but after you get to that point you have to sell so many cabins in order to get your phd when you get your phd in norwegian cruise line guess what free cruise familiarization cruises also watch for fam cruises if there's going to be some kind of a cruise line that's going to offer their training on a cruise line watch for these cre uh, uh, cruise offers what i'm most excited about is that in travmanity we were told at convention our cruise world is going to explode so we're going to have a lot more opportunity to do some various trainings uh, group-wise and also familiarization cruises that our um, CEO, uh, Shelly Coppersmith, 
is going to be putting out there. So be sure and keep watching, keep up with everything that's available on the um, in the cruise world. Okay, I wanted to give you one more uh, screen share. I don't want to lose my little. Um, I'm going to stop share for a minute. Oh, I lost my black. Oh, sure. Here we go. Okay. I'm going to tell you a big cruise secret. A big cruise secret. And we're going to end with this, but this is for agents only because this website is a competitor. It is a big competitor of ours, okay? So it is called iCruise, iCruise.com, but here's where I, why I like it so much. You can go to Cruise Lines, like I just clicked on Cruise Lines. You can see my screen now, right? Okay, you can see all the river cruises, okay? Cruise Lines. You can see all the river cruise lines are way over to the right, okay? AMA, waterways, they have some great familiarization trips. Okay. Um, the other cruise lines, these are ocean back here. And so why do I like that? Because you can have your own, you can understand the products, okay? This particular, um, this particular cruise, deck plan that I'm going to show you right here is a on the uh, the Grand Princess. Okay, this is a Princess Cruise Line. Why do I want you to see these colors? Because it's color coordinated as to what price you're going to pay for what category of cabin that you're going to get. Okay, it's color coded over here. See where it says the deck? on the side, it's color coded. So when you're booking your client, if they always wanna be in the middle of the ship, okay, they're going to pay more because in the middle of the ship is the most expensive. The higher you get on the cruise decks, it's going to be more expensive. As you go out, it's going to get less these ones that are on the inside, that means that they don't have a window, okay? Those are inside cabins when they're over there in the center. But with all of these, that is how you're going to tell what your pricing is. Right now, we are on, you can also see your deck plan right here. This is the Carib deck, okay? If I went on up to the Aloha deck, there's the A's. Now, if I go to the Lido deck, I've still got cabins, but they're going to be over or under, I mean, under the horizon court. Why is that? Because why is that necessary that you know? Because it's noisy at six o'clock in the morning. They're moving chairs around. They're getting ready for that buffet breakfast. It is crazy, crazy busy. So Aloha, uh, Aloha, you would not want to probably put one of your clients on the Aloha deck knowing that you're right under the Lido. Brian, did you have a question? Is the Lido deck always the Lido deck on whatever cruise line you're on? You know, you've just got to go to your cruise line and- I need a question. Sure. Oh, sorry, yeah. Uh, Brian was asking, is the Lido deck always the deck that has like the buffet, for example? Not necessarily. And that's why you need to go to your cruise line and you need to go your, to your deck plan. See, when you go down here on the left, you can see what's on the Lido deck. This is another reason why I like this website. Look at, I'm going to click on what is the deck legend. OK, I'm going to click on the deck legend. It's going to tell me what those little what the triangle is about, what a 
circle is about, what a circle in black is about. Now you can go over to one of these cabins and click on a cabin and you can see what it's going to look like. Mm -hmm. It's also going to tell you the size. It's going to tell you the stateroom size. It's going to tell you usually how big the, the deck is if you're in a balcony like this one's a balcony. It's also going to tell you the category. This is a category BF. Okay, so your BF is going to be a different category and a different price than your BE or your BC or your BA. So that's how you tell your uh, pricing. You can also tell public areas, the deck legend, and you can also uh, okay. You can also do a ship summary. What will the ship summary tell you? Number one, this is the Grand Princess, right? Okay. But it also tells you it was built in 1998. It was refurbished in 2019. What is the category? It's a premium. So you know that's a little bit higher than you're going to find on most cruise lines. It's going to tell you how many maximum passengers you've got the number of crew and uh, a lot of information right there. So that's the importance of being able to tell about the various cruise lines. I want to repeat again, do not give this website to your clients. Do not. I made that mistake once and he said, oh, well, their price is cheaper than yours. You know, then I had to go and unwind all of that. The other thing about cruising is that when you have a booking, you want to make sure the difference between the gross price and the net price. The gross price is what the client pays. Never, ever, ever send them a copy of a booking that has that is intended for an agent because it's going to have the gross, it's going to have the net. It's going to tell what your commission is. So you never want to send them a copy and send it to yourself first before you send it to your client and make sure that it's the right one. I've also made that mistake. I've made about every mistake that there is. So um, uh, that's basically uh, what I wanted to share with you tonight. Um, I did want to say that uh, I know I'm trying to multitask here. I just wanted to say, do you want to join me? You know, we love cruising. We would love working with you. Any of your groups that want to work with, we will work with you. We have been extremely blessed with this company. This company taught me what I know about being a travel advisor. I absolutely am thrilled that the back office in Travmanity is going to be upgraded, updated, new information, all of this new training that we're going to have. And I tell you, one of the best things you can do is to share the if you know cruisers to be able to share because even if they don't end up joining your business then guess what they're going to be able to cruise with you and you're going to get paid for it so that's what i'm all about getting paid to cruise all right so ann and nick i want to thank you so so much for inviting me here and and this fabulous gay Gaylord yeah, yeah, yeah. party. You should see the spread. We've got fried chicken. We've got, oh my goodness. Uh, Larry said, gosh, I didn't even know we got all this. <laughs> Could you stop sharing your screen for us? Uh, stop share, right? There you go. All right, and back to you. All righty. Okay, well, you're still sharing your screen, I think. I think. Anyway, ladies and gentlemen, we want to thank you so much. I know those of us who are in the business, you know, we have a corporate call coming up where you actually get the hear the the updates from convention. If you are a guest, if you are a guest on the line tonight, 
then I'd love for you to, to get back with the person who invited you. Uh, if you actually filled out a, a if you filled out a, a survey and you actually attended tonight, we have a three day, two night certificate for you. So get back with the person who invited you, make sure that they, that you did fill out the survey and that you have the um, that you, that we, that make sure that you tell them what your number is. And so we want to thank everybody, everybody for for joining us this evening. Hopefully you got some information that you need. If you are a guest on this line, please do not go to I Cruise. You want to get back with the person who invited you on this call. That was you got some proprietary information some proprietary just for the agents. But you want to make sure you support the person who invited you. Find out. Don't let us find out you was on this line and you went on the high cruise. We're going we gonna to have some issues. So with that being said, ladies and gentlemen, thank y'all so much for joining us. Thank you so much. Hopefully you got some information that you can use. We are about to, to eat a little bit and, and, and party a little bit and absolutely enjoy the information that's going to be shared from our corporate offices. And we hope that you will too. We want to thank you so much. We love you. God bless. And we look forward to seeing you. And yes, we do mean you at the top, at the very top. It's going to be the tip top because the bottom is much too crowded. Y'all have a good night and God bless. Bye-bye from the crowd. virtual party good... central at the Gaylord. The Gaylord. Good night, everybody. Love y'all. Bye-bye. Let me know if you if I if I need to who I who who I need to send the certificates out to. Make sure you get back in touch with your guests. Be on the whole time. <laughs> and let me know because some of the, some of our team members won won a prize tonight. If you had more than three guests on tonight, you actually have you have a prize coming to you. So make sure that you that you get back in touch with your guests. Y'all have a good night. Bye bye.